So here's um, just our wiring booths. Basically, it's a freestanding building. Um, the red timbers are uh, the students are not supposed to drill them. Um, all the rest of the timbers are basically quote unquote sacrificial. So the students can uh, drill them, mount their boxes, do their wiring, uh, that sort of thing. Um, we have the ability, we have whiteboard space down here to be able to um, explain things or draw things out for our students. So we have, uh, again, 16 of these. Eight on the main floor and eight on the upper floor. Each, uh, the space, there's three of these buttons. These buttons shut the, the power is off right now. It shuts the power off to this whole area. So if there's a student uh, gets a shock or is being shocked, uh, we can turn that off there. It also, students cannot energize anything until the instructor's here. So, safety thing. Good. So that's the main floor of this. So this is a typical wiring booth. We have 16 booths set up like this. Um, so this student is currently hooking up, uh, appears to be baseboard heat. Uh, where are we? There's a baseboard heater. There's the panel. So this cord, the pigtail on that power cord, will come over and connect into that safety switch. So each student's booth has um, power's turned off right now, but each student's booth has an arc fault, a ground fault um, receptacle. And they have a, this is 120 volt, and they have a 120, 240 volt single phase 20 amp um, receptacle that connects into there. So then you put the plug in, that pigtail will go into there. And then once it's in there, then you can turn the power on there. Again, the master switch for these has been shut off. But yeah, we have eight on the ground floor and eight of these on the upper floor. Um, primarily our construction method in Canada is wood frame construction. Um, we'll continue on. And we'll go up the stairs here. So this is, again, basically just like the first floor. Um, wiring, wood frame. Uh, each of the booths are the same. You can see the pigtails there. Our wiring project for the power sources for our uh, safety disconnect switches is not yet 100% complete. So we are using these single phase transformers temporarily to uh, give us our 120 240 volt supply. So where you use twin and ground, uh, we do use uh, two wire NMD90 as well, and three wire. Uh, our wiring systems are a little bit different between our countries. Um, your single phase is straight single phase 240 volt and uh, our single phase is 120 240. We use what's called a three wire circuit. So that's our wiring space.